Welcome back to Emotional Mojo. So if your New Year's resolution includes anything like losing weight, quitting smoking, or even just starting a workout plan, Dr. Kim and Dr. Mario are here to help you transform your life beyond your wildest wildest dreams. The Thrive Doctors, we love you guys. We're so happy to have you back here. Happy holidays and it's so awesome to be back here again. We want to make it even more happy in the new year, but I have to be a little bit of a bummer here and say according to a Gallup poll, only 8% of people are actually successful in achieving their resolutions. Why are so many of us failing? Most Help. people make the <laughs> same resolutions year after year, but they don't do the essential things that are needed to actually have success and follow through for transformation, and that's what we're going to show you today. So whatever, oh, yes. whatever the goal is, there <laughs> yeah. are steps you can take. You guys have five, right? We want to transform our life from the inside out. And we're going to start right steps? now. We have a special treat for Jada oh. to start crushing what is crushing us. So Jada, oh. I need you to step right over oh. here. We heard about your habit, Jada, with okay. the that junk chips. food. Calling your name. The junk. So we're going to step on the junk. Oh. Jada. Oh. So I People have ever been overwhelmed by the bag of potato chips right. that runs the show for you. Right. You don't even have say. The chips are dominating you. We are getting oh. ready to and this do is really it. important it, for all the viewers, guys, because <laughs> Get it. now that you're going to be seeing how Jada steps on that, that creates a connection with yes, your brain. Yes, it does. This uh -huh. is not good. So you're going to be jumping and stepping oh, I meant on it. to jump. Oh, Get absolutely. It. Oh. Let's do it. it. Woo! Chips. Dominating the chips right there. Show them who's boss. We had the same thing with you. But it's true. So they're too good. There is a connection, though, between what you're doing and what it's telling your mind. Yes. Right? What you're plugging into your brain about how you think about food. The game is over. You're in charge. You're going to put real gifts into your body. Oh, so, my gosh. It so so smells so, so good. Sorry about that. Oh, Junk is gone, guys. Okay. okay, what else do you got? The Thrive Framework has to do, the first part is thoughts. You are going to plug into your mind what it is you want to attain in the new year. So if you have a journal, for example, super powerful tool, super inexpensive, yep, right? Yeah. You just find a composition, little notebook. You want to put in what it is you're intending. When right. you write things down, you write down your intention, it gets mm -hmm. programmed in a different right. part of your brain that allows you to That's take right. action. It's like taking notes mm -hmm. in school, you yeah. know, you're writing it down, That's right. and you're, you're committing, committing to it when you write it down, you're committing versus the just, oh, I want to do this. Yeah. And the great thing about clear. it is that if it's written, you can always go back to that and yes. see it and get inspired. This is what I really wanted for my new year. I created that, Remind and that yourself. just reminds you, yeah. and it just brings it And on. you wrote it Love down it. during the time you were most motivated, when you really That's wanted it. So when you want sight. to connect. The next part we yes. have. Ooh. We have a special, a special activity for you. Stand up all of you guys. One of this the is biggest really reasons we don't stick to the commitments we make is because we're overwhelmed with the stress response in our body. It's the okay. sympathetic nervous system, the fight or flight response, and one of the biggest ways you can turn that off is through your breathing. Okay. So everybody take a big, deep breath. Take a deep breath. And just exhale, blow the air out. This is another habit. Smoking. Ugh. How many of you know someone who has ever been Ooh, a smoker and would like to take the habit, right? So you're going to break. You're going to dominate. Dominate. We're going to break the Crush it. Crush it. Crush. Just like that bag of chips. You're going to end no, that no. habit. Clean this up, guys. I know our director's like, what are you doing? But one of the things that happens when people are smoking, they take a break and they're mindfully breathing. It relaxes the body and shuts off that fight or flight response. Right. We're going to teach you to do it here. Take a big, deep breath. Put the whistle up and exhale. <laughs> and then just how do you feel right now? I'm like excited. I'm going to go fun. run or something. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Relax. But Jada said it, it's relaxed, it's fun. It's so fun. you have complete change, what's happening internally, and how many of us are stressed every day. Yeah. And all we have to do is just yeah. breathe with a whistle. Pay attention yeah. to your breathe, slow, deep breathing. Yeah, this makes sense because you're yeah. purposely thinking about making the sound and exhaling. So yeah, you gotta be a little conscious of what you're doing, right? The next piece is I for inspiration. Why did you make these resolutions in the first place? Why do you want to be fit? Why do you want to lose weight? Why do you want to stop smoking? Imagery, fitness imagery of beautiful, fit, healthy people. If you are to see these images regularly or tie in the behavior like eating less or eating healthy, eating lots of greens with your why. Why do I want to do this? Whoa, there's me 10 years ago 
kids in a slim fit body or there's my beautiful child mm -hmm. I want to stick around for my right. healthy child and be a so healthy adult. Motivation. You have to plug it in in your awareness and be aware of what inspires you. And the powerful sure. thing is that when we have a visual image it binds that in our brains mm -hmm. and it's much easier for us to be able to move in that direction. Why? Because we have something that we are already seeing. Right. It's much easier. It's just like going for a target. Yeah, yeah you, you're never going to be successful quitting weight, quitting smoking or losing weight if you don't have that really powerful why. It's not just, oh, I want to do it because I know I'm not supposed yeah, to. It's gotta be a you got to know that you know. That. And what yeah, were the last? The last one up. is V for your vision. You have to know what is my ultimate outcome. Where am I really going with this and why am I doing this? And the same thing, write it down. Use your journal so that every day you have your vision of what am I really creating here? Where am I relative to that and why? Why am I even bothering? to do that kind so like you're that super clear year career plan it's more like that personal where do i want to be at the end of 20 yes, right and it's a day to day and lastly if you don't change your environment the letter e is going to be very hard so how do we do that we have all these resolutions how can we keep ourselves on track you stomp it and throw it on the floor yeah. that's one way of <laughs> doing it well, the easy, it i know the easy way that's a great way is have an accountability partner. Yeah, have a yeah. friend in the family. Like that. Grab yeah. that phone once a week. Call them. Listen, remember that I said that I was going to lose 10 pounds? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you, I've lost eight. The other person was like, like eight pounds? You're there. You're getting yeah. there. Yeah. Accountability partners are something or, that hey, nobody I'm talks about. Today. Or the opposite. Yeah, I, need I to totally to flaked. Me yeah. I haven't been yeah. to the gym in a month, but you're going to check in every single week or in a regularly scheduled way. Mm -hmm. That way your New Year's resolution isn't something you make in the beginning of the year and then you forget about it until the following year. Yeah. You are checking in regularly with your account. It's super yeah. powerful yes. when you have somebody that is hearing your declaration of what your life is going to be like. They will keep you accountable. They'll be part of your success. And if you're failing, it's not a failure. They'll be there to cheer you and up. And you know what? you got to have the energy and motivation. This guy's on the edge of his seat. And he's right. so excited to share this info. So thank you, the Thrive Doctors. Make sure you guys check them out. We will link you up on our website. We have a series, a five-series video you can have as well to train people in this specific.